guys, Charlotte here, and I have a bit of a book haul for you today. Um, I don't get a ton of books at once, so this is sort of like in my mailbox too. Yeah, it's just a book gathering. They're all gathering together. So I have one, two, three, four, five, six books here, and some of them I ordered online, most of them, but then the other two are from other times. That makes sense? Okay. The first one is there there was a giveaway on some of the blogs uh, some blogs that I saw and I entered a lot of them. I entered like 50 literally for Midsummer's Eve giveaway and I won one of them. So this actually came a week or two ago, but as I'm saying, I don't have enough books at once to buy it, to to make the haul, so now I'm doing it. So this is Hunger and isn't it an epic cover? I love this cover. Yeah. And it is by Karen E. Taylor and she was the one who actually sent it to me. So yeah. Woo. And oh, yeah. It's about um Dead Dre Dear Dre Griffin and she's a vampire. And these, this is not the original book. There were a few, I think she wrote them in the 1990s. And this is just the new released cover. And I have to say I'm excited to read this one. And then this one has been on my to read to list for a long time. And it is One Night That Changes Everything. And it is by Lauren Barnholt. It is about a girl whose journal is stolen, or notebook. And it has like everything in it about people, about her, about her friends, and her ex-boyfriend steal them. And it says that on the back, so that's not a spoiler. And um, he has to, he's blackmailing her basically, and she has to do all this stuff in one night. Or he'll expose everything online. <sighs> Boyfriends. And this one I got recently. Um, and it is How to Ditch Your Fairy. I thought it was a new release because I'd never seen it before. But it is not. It was written in 2008. But anyway, this looks good. This is about a girl who has... Um, she lives in a world where everyone has personal fairies. That sounds cool. Um, and hers is um, a f like best spot in the lot fairy. I thought this was amusing. Her fairy... Whenever the fairy is in the car, they get the best spot in the parking lot. She can't even drive. <laughs> so yeah, this is about how to ditch your fairy. And this one has also been on my to-read list for a while. This is one I bought online. Um, the Replacement by Brianna Yanoff. Wait. Yovanoff, sorry. I am not good at pronouncing things. Isn't that an eerie cover? And it is about... A boy who is a replacement, sort of. He is Mackie. That's his name. He is a replacement. This is kind of like, it's a mysterious book. I don't want to give anything away. I haven't actually read it. But he, basically he's a replacement. I'm gonna say that. City of Bones. I bought this online and it was used. It's like not very good quality. But I don't really care because it's a book. There's, if there's no pages ripped out, I'm fine. Um, and this is self-explanatory because, yeah, the mortal instruments. And I'm going to read the series in time for the movie, which I think they're still casting, so I have a good amount of time. And this is the last one, Love, Inc. This is actually my first book on my to-read list on Goodreads, so that is progress. And it is about a girl who is, a few girls actually, I think it's three friends, and um, their business is love. Yeah. I'm sorry if I've shown these books. I think I might have shown Hunger in another book, in another video, but um, I don't know. See, I just grabbed a few books off my bookshelf that I got recently, and I was like, let's make a video! So yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Bye!